Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm going to be telling you how to configure your integrated laptop camera with your virtual Ubuntu. So my virtual Ubuntu is running on Oracle VM virtual box. Let's get started. First, we need to open Firefox. By the way, I have a HP NV laptop, Windows 10, with Windows 10. Over here, you want to type VBOX extension pack. And from the original website, virtualbox.org, downloads. I have version 6.1.18. So I'm going to be downloading the extension pack for 6.1.18. If you have older builds, then you want to select the older build. So if you click this, you can save the file. But I already have the extension pack, so I'm going to leave it. Next, you need to open VirtualBox. Go to File. Click on Preferences. In preferences, click on extensions. So you can see I have integrated the 6.1.18. This is the extension pack. And if it's not uh, added, then you can just click on add the new extension package and then go to the uh, file in which you have saved it and select it. Click on OK. Now you can restart your VirtualBox Manager. And it usually it shows like installed or successfully completed. So I'm going to close it. Now we have to log into Ubuntu. Give me my password. Okay, by then, over here on the devices, there should be something called webcams now after restarting and starting the virtual machine. And you can see HP True Vision, that's the name of my integrated camera of this laptop, select it and check whether it is selected. Yes, it is selected. In case you cannot see the webcams option, Go to your virtual machine settings, go to user interface, under devices, make sure webcams is ticked. So make sure webcam is ticked over here. As you can see, it's ticked for me now. Click on OK. So now by default, I don't know why, but cheese does not recognize the camera. So we need another trusted camera software. To install it, open terminal, control alt T and type this sudo apt get install G U V C V I E W. Command is in the description down below. Click on enter. I've already downloaded it, so It's all it's saying that it's already the latest version and nothing to upgrade. Let's close terminal. Open the application list. And you can see G U V C V I D E W. I've already started this program. And you can see my effect. <laughs> Isn't that very funny? So I can increase anything I want. In video controls, let me just show my original face. This is my original face. 30 frames per second is the max. And you can see virtual box webcam, HP True Vision, it recognizes it. You can set the size or make it full screen over here. And it is also capable of recording videos, so you can do capture video and it will start recording or just quit so it will quit everything there are many effects so you can see like this is the mirror effect 
pop, mirror, and there are many things that you can play around with, and audio controls, you can make it in, in your recording, your voice can be echoed, or it can be heard, and I have selected Ducky here, I don't need that. So basically, you can now change it. The only problem is, every time you start your VM, you'll have to select, you have to go to devices and select your camera. If you have um, USB cameras, then you can directly select it from the USB, or you can get it from, uh, from the webcams option too. So thank you for coming to this video. Hope it was informative. If it was, then please like, subscribe to my channel for more gaming and informative videos. See you later.